what's up, 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 just kind of uh, waiting on it to load right now. It's a rising amount of time. Where we last left off, however, we were assaulted by the green HOA. And so now we're just trudging through the uh, miles of paperwork that we have to do. By paperwork, I mean all the green homeless people that are clawing at our faces trying to uh, get a hold of it. Oh, 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 oh. I think we have it. I think we have it. I think we have it. Hey guys, how's it going? You're my favorite here. Come here. Give me a hug. Give me a hug. Give me a hug. Hug. Enhance. 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 All right, we're all done here. Wagwan. Wagwan? I wouldn't know anything about that, would I? Dob, welcome to the stream. Wagwan? That's slang for what's going on? I wouldn't know about that either. Hurry up and give me on my live screen. Doom last saved. Let's hurry up and get this shit going. There we go. What's happening today is I'm about ready to die continuously to these little green butt-fucking mutants. Well, technically speaking, um, I still have a choice to make. Now, do I take door number one and deal with uh, ass-eating mutants? Or do I go down door number two and deal with uh, ass-eating robots? This is... Now, this is more is more the style that I'm looking for. Now, I notice with the robots, um, they don't deal as much damage. However, they keep fucking stun-locking me. Now, with the mutants, they don't stun-lock me, but they deal significantly more damage. I think I used up all my healing supplements. So, honestly, there could be a case for me going all the way back and getting some. And, and I'm only like half, I only have half health right now. Literally, I'm at 52%. Not a very good case right now. Not a very good case. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna start off by trying out the, uh, I'm gonna start off by trying out the robot alley. Robot Rimposium. Rimjob Posium. Mmm. Mmm. Give that a go. Now, as you can see, I already went through here a little bit. There were like three robots that tried to stop me in the middle of uh, traffic here, but oh yeah, I did. I can't act as anything. That most likely has life saving medication for me right now. What kind of fucking nudge is this? Shit, shit, shit. Shoot it. Oh, wow, I actually, uh, I actually made that. Alright, well. I guess I got caught by a security camera. So it's time for me to check and see over here if, uh, anything got... If anybody's coming over here. Oh, shit, those two did. Okay, so, apparently there's two more robots that are around here somewhere. Flying over around there. Trying to make sure I don't fucking bump into him. Oh shit. Got to bump into him. I circle around this way, maybe? That one. Uh. But he's in here, and let me try that. No. Hmm. I'm so low on health. So low on health, man. 
on health. I don't have any healing utensils, and I'm so low on health, man. What is this? Advanced health hypo? Alright, I'll take that. Where the hell is it? That. Do that. How do you make that? Advanced health hypo. Blood. Okay. Advanced health hypo can be created by mixing healthy animal blood with gel electrolyte and taurine. Organic gel electrolyte, syringe taurine. Well, I do have taurine. I do have syringes. But I don't have any blood or oh, gel electrolytes. Oh, sorry. Let me just uh, let me just fish those out of my other pants. Gel electrolytes? How the hell do you even farm that shit? God, there's nothing anywhere. How am I supposed to survive? That's how they make Red Bull. Yes, they put the blood in the electrolyte touring thing. Oh, shit. How much health do I have? Did that man miss the uh, stun? My god, he did. Can I? No, it's a fragmentation grenade. That would that probably wouldn't do anything. Um, maybe I could just close the door, hang out like right over here, wait for him to come along. Pass turn. He's gonna have to come to me. Open the door. Dude, that'd be fucking... Dude, this would be absolutely hilarious if the sentry bot, since he doesn't have any arms, can't fucking open the door. That'd be very great. Can I, can I in combat? He can't open the door. He can't open the door. He can't open the door. Can I open the door? Right there. <laughs> Taser. There we go. Now we're talking. Can't fucking he can't open the door. Boo! Oh my god. Now come through the door. Up. Am I gonna survive this? Don't flashbang me, please. Don't flashbang me. Ooh, this is gonna call it tight, man. Ooh, I got it. Got it, boys. We got here. Fla oh, so I do have a flashbang. All right. Grenades are used to temporarily neutralize the combat effectiveness of enemies by disorienting their senses. All right, box? No. Never a box. Shelf? No. Shelf? Ew, no, fine. Fine, I'll take that. Fine, I'll bend to your whim. That's more like it. Anything else in here? Lockers. North gate key card. The north automatic gate in the old junkyard. The north automatic gate in the old junkyard. Oh! Bacon and cheese sandwich. And canned fish. Damn, how about that? Fusion cell? Oh my god. This primary battery facilitates extremely small-scale nuclear fusion in order to produce a single high-energy discharge. Holy shit. And a Mark II lockpick? Damn, alright. Anything in here? Soft foam padding and energy edge emitter can be attached to melee weapon with a cutting edge to emit energy on impact, but sacrificing the sharpness of the edge. Energy edge emitter. Fuck, there is some there is some toys in here. I can't I can't get that toy. Speaking of uh, inability to get toys, Errol? No. Bacon and cheese sandwich, please. Didn't increase my health. I did not increase my health. Can I get over there? No? Alright. Well, uh, I'm on a very I'm in a very tight schedule here. Actually, you know what? Give me uh give me over here so I can check out 
Fuck, they're both there. <sighs> what are we gonna do, Tub? Fuck is going on here? Door? No. Door? No. Oh my god! I can't get in any of these doors or boxes or anything! Oh shit. Don't flashbang me, please. I got flashbanged. I'm so low. Um, I need, I need this fucking gun to, I need this grenade to do something. Please don't kill me. Alright, not that bad, not that bad, not that bad. Oh, did it kill one of them? No, it did not. Okay. Oh. Oh. Living on a prayer. Um. Dude, thank God for lack of gun skills just... Barely coming in, barely coming in here. Oh, what the fuck? No, hold on. Blow this up here. Can we take- No, 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 wrong way, dude. Come in here. Come in here. Oh, no, the auto turrets, no! I didn't even notice fucking auto turrets. Holy shit, there's so much stuff in here. I need to get the fuck out of here. I didn't even notice the auto turrets. I'm about to get reamed, aren't I? Oh my god, I have 16 health. Please get me out of here. Please get me out of here. Am I okay now? Am I finally okay? Past turn. What do I have left? I have 16 health points. Oh my god. Could I... Where the hell is it? There you go. Put that there. Could I just real quick... Could I real quick just like come over here? Hit the E button. That's so far away though. There's so much stuff over there. There's got to be some sort of healing implement over there. There's got to be. All right, what's over here? There's like a single sentry bot over here, isn't there? Might have a better chance over here. There was a lot more than a single sentry bot over here. I don't like this. I don't like these odds, boys. I don't like these odds, boys. <sighs> Pass turn. This is not good. Can I like stealth mode? See if these guys see me. Oh, he sees me. Don't stop. I'm not surviving this. What do I have left? I have three health. I have two health. There it is. I'm gone. Okay, how far back did it send me? Okay, right here. Alright. First things first. Um, I think it was this room. It had a mine in it? No, but there was nothing in here anyways. That was a red herring. But over here, there's only a single bot... And there was some stuff in here. Damn, that fucking... Oh my god. That first time he was... He was just sitting there... Throwing away, but now, now he's... Now he's fucking... Now he's on... He's on point now. now. Let me... Let me get over here in the corner. Get over here in the corner. Now come here. There you go. Hey, what's up? How you doing?
Oh, I have my gun out! No! Oh, can you be any more cringe? Well, probably would have ended out that same exact way if I even had my sledgehammer out, so... No harm, no foul. Box, no. Shelves, no. Shelves, no. Oh, wait, no, no, no. Shelf had something. Yeah, the acid bolt. So come over here, pick up the stuff in the locker. Get that. The key card for the old north junkyard or whatever the fuck. Over here, grab that. That. These boxes had some stuff, though. I remember that. I remember. I remember that. Ha! <laughs> had some stuff. Fucking science fiction. So, top. Glad you're here. Uh, wanted to ask you. Wanted your opinion on shit show. Now, oh, can I can I shoot that? There we go. Well, I'm blowing through all my ammunition right now. The locker? What the fuck? Oh. Wait, how many were there? There was like two there. Uh. I could swing by over here. Fuck yeah, there he is right there. Don't flashbang me, please. Don't flashbang me, please. He flashbanged me. Oh shit, I'm okay. Yeah, I'm gonna hide behind this corner here. Wait for them to come around. Dude, don't fuck. Don't cheat that corner like that. That's not cool. That's not cool. I'm not appreciative of that. Fuck. Where's the other one? The fuck's the other one? Oh, there he is. Okay, now, can I get behind the corner again? You can, like, over here? Nice, dude. Flee! Flee for your life! So, Tob, since you're here, wondering, um, Daniel and Varun have been uh, have been itching to get into something a bit more concrete, some bit more continuous, an actual campaign. Not as many one shots for as far as shit show goes. However, they've been wanting to do something a bit different. Starfinder, you ever hear of it, Tob? Bit of a different platform. Can I get that shot in? I don't want to get tased. I feel like I'm gonna get tased. Yeah, I can't do that. All right. So it's take it's it's a bit of a sci-fi angle. Got no idea what that is. So it's it's like a sci-fi angle, right? We're playing where it's it's yeah it's like a tech with a little bit of magic. Who's the other person? Well, there's Daniel and Varun. Varun is at shit show. Have you been watching our shit shows? Have you been watching our shit shows, Cameron? Ah, huh? or at least the ones that work. Varun's the other guy on the can at the uh, at the dean. Oh my god, man! This guy, these guys are determined to keep me stun locked here. God, am I gonna end up with any health by the end of this? Is it even gonna be worth it? No, you do it in the week when I've got work. That's true. That's true. All right, come here. Give me some shit. All right. Well, quick save. Now that I've killed two of them. Yeah, I do. I do do it in the week when you got work. I mean, because Daniel works weekends, and Varun usually doesn't have a lot of time either. So this is me doing it when they've got time. Me when they've got time, you know. They've got time. Well, there's always the VODs. There's always the VODs of having clean VODs by the end of it for you to be able to see if you end up wanting to. There's always that. Okay, can I maybe... Oh, I have EMP grenades. I forgot I have that. Do I have any more? I do. Could I maybe... Here we go.
Okay. And then replace the other one with a high explosive. No, 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 no. Uh, where the fuck do I have it? I had it. I had it here a second ago. Oh, shit. There it is. If you got into a long-term concrete campaign, I'd probably watch the VODs. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that was essentially what I was trying to, trying to figure out. Um... Thank you for your opinion, Tob. Something a bit more long-term, they say. I can get behind that. I don't have a lot of health, man. I'm gonna have to figure this out. Alright, let me get over here, actually. <laughs> let me quick save right here. Okay. Now, if you were looking for a long-term... Now, if you're looking for a long-term relationship here, Tob... Is there anything you'd like to see? Like, would you want, would you, I guess, I guess one question, for example, would be, uh, would you want me to be DM, or would you want me to be a PC, a player character, somebody actually partaking in the campaign? Well, I mean, as a DM already partakes in the campaign, because they, I mean, they, they kind of build the thing. But I mean, like, PC, a player character, isn't somebody that I actually participate in the game with. I have water, so if anybody has any hydrations, please, by all means, redeem them. Cocksuckers. Now, come here. Mm, this is holy shit. He's right on the. He's like coming right off the bat with that. Fuck off. Can I get that shot in? Can I get that? Can I get that in there? Can I get that in there? Yes, dude. Yes, dude! Alright, um, first things first, can I get... Then can I do this too? I probably just fucking killed myself there with that one. Um, <clears throat> I mean, if he was playing, who would DM? Daniel. Daniel was thinking about DMing. I think he was the one that wanted to DM this game. Can I end him? Can I end his life? Son of a bitch. I could have EMP'd. So I, I can EMP. Come a little closer, baby. And then HE. Okay, now, try this again. I'm gonna have to- I'm gonna have to save scum this now. I had a perfect EMP throw that first time and I SPOILED it! With my INSOLENCE! Can I- okay, so I can still do that. 28% is a little bit better. Well, that was, uh, hmm. As long as it's interesting, I'm sure it wouldn't matter. The goblin scene in the first one shot was fire. The goblin scene in the first one shot. The goblin scene. Goblin scene. In the first one shot, we made... Which which goblin scene? Because it was that because it was that whole uh, arena thing. You mean like in the very beginning, or what do you mean? Maybe swing over here. Can I still throw this? I don't have enough points. All right. Yeah, the arena. Good. I'm glad that was the one I uh, that was the one I put a little uh, try to put a little effort in. Red Hot American Summer levels of uh, campaign, D&D &D shit going on here. Alright, well, I'm probably going to end up getting killed here anyways. Don't flashbang me. Oh, he missed me. Look at that, he missed me. Bastard missed me. Oh, perfect, got him. Ooh, I might be able to end his life right now. I might be able to end his life right now. It was great. I do actually need to go back and watch the rest of it. 
I, uh... We're, we're also sticking to Mondays as far as uh, shit show goes because Thursdays at the studio are just abysmal. Like, the internet connection there is horrendous. But we're also going to be moving the set very soon here to uh, someplace a little lower in quality because uh, we're, we're planning on, like, buckling down and saving up for uh, a bigger and better place soon. Well, a friend of mine's planning on getting a bigger, better place that we could host the place there. Um, but it, it probably won't happen for, like, half a year. So until then, we're going to be buckling down, doing a, trying our best to maintain sobriety. Please don't kill me, auto turret. Please don't kill me, auto turret. Please don't kill me. Oh, I can't kill anyone. Is raiding with a party of one? You can kill that one. Kill him right now. Speaking of I can't kill anyone, my god, welcome to the stream. Today we'll be playing uh, Under Rail, where I, uh, for the life of me, can't kill anyone. Is that why you raided me? Is that why you raided me? How's it going? I can't kill anyone. I can't kill anyone. I don't have any healing utensils. I don't have any. I don't have any healing utensils. Uh, and I and I'm forced to go through one of two gauntlets. Is essentially what's happening right now. I need to eight ball this. Is what needs to happen. Hold on a minute. I need. I actually need to eight ball this. Eight ball. The any route to today's mission. Please. Oh my god. Eight ball hates me. Alright, live screen again. Let's go anyways. Um can I can I possibly survive this? Can I possibly survive this? Why is he just hanging out there? Can I eliminate this man? Okay. I've swapped one sin for another. <laughs> True. I don't see a lot of hammer playthroughs. Understandable. This is my first time ever playing Under Rail, and I thought I'd just, you know, go melee build, because what's the worst that can happen? And here I am. The worst that could happen. Is that one, like, out of commission? No, okay, it's there. It's there. It's there. Can I circle around and then get the swing in? Because I don't want to deal with that guy anymore. You let the viewers decide the character? <laughs> it was pretty crazy. Yet, yeah, uh... Was problematic. God, I'm gonna die right now, aren't I? 18 health. Yep, there it is. I'm dead. You're out of hypos. Hypos bandages the works. I'm out of everything. I'm out of everything. I had like 12 of both, and I slowly burnt through it all, going through the junkyard in uh, junk in junk town. Poop. That's right. That's right. I can't kill anyone. Be sure to regard seize the gap. Welcome to the stream, both of you. Uh, they, they have a very big fondness of poop. You're like halfway through, to be honest. You're going to need more. Now, normally I'm not against spoilers, but however, this, this was, uh, this was, this is, this is intellectually putting me out of my misery as far as letting me know the progress right now. I'm halfway through the original scrapyard. That's, yeah, I am going to end up having to fucking go back and get more. The backtracking right now. My god. Somebody put me out of my fucking misery. Well, I might as well see if I can clear this room out. Or maybe if I'm up against the wall, I'll only be able to deal with him. Can I... Can I get that? Can I get that? Well, I did end up getting them all. <laughs> well, I ended up pulling it off. Somehow. Alright, well. I'm over here. And I guess you said my turn. Wait, what the fuck? What the hell's shooting at me? Is it the other one over there on the back? 37. 42. 37, 38. Uh, actually, guess you're a bit closer than that to the end, to be fair. Okay, so it's like, so, I, so I'm like at like a 45% mark is what's happening right now. Either way, it sounds like my fat ass is going to have to go back to uh, Junktown Ikea in order to get my Swedish meatball on. Please! Don't kill me. Well, I, okay. Okay. 
It was it was off, but it was a happy accident. Dude, I dude, I'm fucking idiot savanting this whole thing. My god. Please. Oh, safe mode. Don't kill me, don't kill me, don't kill me. Don't kill me. Don't kill me. Fuck! <clears throat> I need a taser. Fuck. Fuck. Brent, I can't let you do that. Get killed by the same robot three times in one sitting. You cockbite. You cockbite. You cockbite of a game. You cockbite of a game. You were waiting for me. You are waiting for me to do that, weren't you? Alright, well, wake up call. Time for me to head back. Welcome everybody to the poop stream. You're gonna watch me walk back and uh fucking get my stuff and then come back. I know viewers love to watch backtracking. Alright, send me back. Uh where the fuck do I go? Okay, so ooh, this might hold on, this might do it. And I go through this looks like something was blown up over here. This looks like somebody somebody blew up their house from there. Okay, so I got a key card. Do that key card go to this? Does not appear to be so. Don't worry, on my stream I was walking for like half an hour encumbered selling shit to different merchants. Dude. Hashtag underrail problems. Can we can we be honest here? Dude. It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter how. It doesn't matter how far you are, what level. I'm level 7, man. I'm the cream of the crop here. I should be, I should be, I should be walking around on death row inmates, showing them the very meaning of pissing their pants. And it's, and instead, here I am, once again, I'm going the distance. Oh wait, trapdoor. Okay, so I think this is a trapdoor. Yeah, I'll take that. Can I see your build? Oh yeah, sure. Let me <laughs> let me real quick skim through that. Here, uh, here. Uh, let me uh, let me do my thing. Let me do my thing. Uh, okay, character sheet. Uh, big, strong, dumb. Big, strong, and dumb. Right? We got some big, strong, and dumb. For some reason, my agility went up one instead of down one. Big, strong, and dumb. Right? Skills. Uh, somebody told me to put points in throwing, so I put points in throwing after the fact. Otherwise, it's just been dumping in a melee. And then, a little bit of dodge and evasion, because there there was a time there, guns 15-2, there was a time there where I was unsure of which direction to go. And I was, I was a lost sheep amongst wolves. I was, I, I just, I just didn't know what to do, so I just dumped points that I'll never get back into, uh, points that I'm never gonna use. Like stealth meatball. I had points in stealth, because I thought for a second there I was going to be able to be stealthy for a while there. Like, walk, like be able to close the gap first, before I start swinging. But no. No, I, I'd, I'd have rather, like, get points into hacking and lockpicking, because my god, I keep bumping into the goddamn things. I keep bumping into doors I need to hack, the fucking boxes I need to hack, doors I need to lockpick, boxes I need to destroy. Mechanics, electronics, tailoring. I wish I had more points in here, too. But, uh, can't do that. I had, a. Uh, we had, now, as a joke, we ended up with points in metathermics and thought control because this bitch, this bitch is heavy. This was, this was some of the part where chat was determining some of the build, and we ended up having some psionics in there. A little bit of psionics in there. Uh, but we still have yet to awaken her psionic potential. Because when the doctor was talking to her about her sonic potential, she thought it was cancer. So she didn't want any of that shit here. How do I realize my cancerous potential? And then just a bunch of intimidation. That was it. And then feats. Here you see before you the rickety yell here. Uh, we have heavy punch because I thought I was going to beat the shit out of people. And then iron grip because I thought I was going to do a shield and a phalanx build. But now here we are. Alright, give me the fuck out of here. Stealth isn't too bad. You can use it for some useful, useful stuff out of combat. I can see that. Um, however... I... Uh, am wearing... I am wearing metal armor. I'm wearing metal armor. Personally, my stealth is horrendous. And I...
Personally, my stealth is horrendous. I steal the plants from the SGS all the time using stealth like the hobo I am. Give me that! Give me that! Give me that! Okay, here I am, right? What the fuck was that? Oh, it was bats. Well, quick, the bats are coming! Fucking uh, uh. kill yourself! Yeah, stealth was nice when I had armor that that uh, that encouraged that. Now stealth is non-existent. All right, give me the fuck out of here. I need to. I, bitch needs to start buying. It's shopping time. I have things. Anybody want to buy stuff from me? Please take this weight off of my shoulders. Anybody? Kendrick. Got some nice hunting gear if you want to look, stranger. Absolutely. Come here, daddy. Um, what the fuck is all this? Okay, take all these belts from me that I don't want. Take all these bolts from me that I don't want. What do you give me? What are you willing to give me? Um, I will take... Okay, uh, back this off. Give me a... What the... Oh, that's an advanced health hypo. Oh, okay, I'll take that. I'll take that. An advanced patching kit. Whoa. All right. Um, utility belt, trapper's belt. Yeah, I just swap out my armor whenever I need something different. Why well, have a wardrobe? But you can just carry one in your inventory. Deploying instant armoire. Beep 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 beep. beep. Hello, Batman. How can I help you today? Yeah, Kendrick's probably the only guy who sells the better ones early on, sometimes. Sometimes. Ah, <sighs> shit. I need bandages, Daddy. Can you give me some of that? Brother, can you give me some bandages? Bear trap, machete, serrated bolts, spear, throwing knives. I do need spear. Oh, wait, no, I already know spear. Okay. Um, and then auto that. Cool. Oh, he doesn't want... Oh, okay, so he doesn't want any of that shit. Alright, auto that. Cool, trade. Cool. Alright. Uh, anybody else? Johan! What do you got, baby? What are you willing to take from me? Spikes. Now, this... Okay. The stuff he wants from me, I kind of want to use. Soft foam padding. Now, I have, like, thin mine case. Yeah, you can take that. Insulating foam padding. This is stuff I want to keep. Uh, what do you have anything on you? Starter mixture, vial, visor. Okay, this is all just, like building crap. Okay. Ooh, batteries, though. Gasoline? Now, fuck off. Take it from me. Okay. Four here. That there. Gimme. I'm so scared! I'm so scared I can't kill anyone! What if I don't find what I'm looking for? Mine shrooms? Four plants or fungi? Perfect. Take this off my hands. Goodbye. Fucking hippie. Alright, what do we got here, baby? Baby Kareem, come on, you gotta have something on you. Let's see what's let's see what's on the menu. Stuff bat and canned fish. Do you have anything good on you? Blue eel, yellow pucker fish, cave hopper steak, eel sandwich. Increases dexterity by one. Fried siphoner tongue increases healing effectiveness by fifteen percent. He's a crazy dog. Mushroom brew is what you're going to want for your build, man. Mushroom brew. Mushroom brew. When consumed, increases strength by 1 and, all and reduces all mechanical damage reduced by 10. But also reduces perception and dexterity by 2. Additionally, all psionics... Yeah, we get it. We get it. We get it. We get it. Um, can I get, like, 5 of this shit? How much is that? 65? Sure. I'll take it. Thanks! Mushroom brew sounds just like it. Alright, give me over here. I have a ton of weapons I'd like to sell. When? <coughs> Ma'am. Alright, I got a lot of shit. Uh, that. Uh, that. That, no. Ammo. Bullet shells or regular bolts. Uh, sniper rifle frame, rifle barrel retractor, 5mm firearm barrel, forward grip, and then the shit ton of all this different ammo that I found here. Take it from me. Take it from me. Take it from me. Okay, now. 
What do I want off of you? Bladed galvanic steel armor. Your successful melee attacks have a 30% chance to inflict a bleeding wound that deals 6 to 10 mechanical damage over 3 turns. But now you can be a constantly drunk, big, chalky lady swinging a hammer. Dude. Dude, if alcohol helped me get places anywhere near as far as Underrail did, I'd be a fucking millionaire by now. Close enough, close enough to Thor. Yeah. I just go like, this, this right here is... This is Mjolnir. This is gonna come to me, my steed, and I... Talk it at him, and... I call it to me. I just, like, walk up to the hammer and pick it up. Come to me, my... Beautiful... Black Obstinance. Metal helmet, metal armor... Fragmine case, flashbang... Bullets... Ball at Clava. Bullets probably make sense. Uh, bladed galvanic steel armor. Can I, uh, can I auto this real quick? Yeah, let me trade. Give me all your money. Oh, wait, no, 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 wait. Oh, he probably didn't have enough money for all that, didn't he? I just oversold to that guy, didn't I? I just ogre sold to that man, didn't I? Alright, solid padding, soft padding, solid padding. Can I get one of these? 280. Oof, that's a lot. But it's better than the helmet I have right now. Alright, what do you got? Five? I'll take that. I'd rather not. Um, I like that blade of Galvanic. 277. What if I put this on the market there too? Nope, that's not anywhere near enough. Alright. <sighs> the taser can be the lightning, you know? By Mjolnir's might! <laughs> this game has its own version of Mjolnir, but instead of being worthy, you need to have enough muscles to use it. But nobody does. Is that a commentary on how Mjolnir in this game is bad? It's okay, I just tape a- I just- I just tape a taser to my fucking sledgehammer, and I can just call it Mjolnir on that. I'm dead rising that shit, where I just, like, keep that shit on there. While, like, Mall Music 4 is going on in the background. Reset. I oversold. I oversold to that fucker. Oh, well. Where the hell can I get bandages, man? Come on, somebody give me bandages. Come on! Gotta be something somewhere. I'm gonna have to go all the way back to the fucking... Uh... I'm gonna have to go all the way back to the station, won't I? Alright. Let me over here. This guy's got stuff. Colty, baby! You wanna do some trading, lady? You got on you. I got nothing you want. Do you have something I want? Circular wave amplifier. The device can be used when crafting energy shield emitters to increase the shielding capabilities, but the cost of energy conversion rate can also be used to periodically amplify energy weapon output. I need health. Pig leather tabby boots. These tabby boots are made of durable pig leather. Movement points increased by 13. Movement speed increased by 12%. Dodge increased by 17. Evasion increased by 17. Action point cost of melee attacks reduced by 1. Constitution increased by 1. Chance to get critically chance to get critically hit by weapon and unarmed attacks increased by 1.5%. The dock is north of the merchant hub. The dock is north of the merchant hub. So be... In your, in your point of view, be like that. Okay. Okay. I like this. I like this. I want this. 48? Absolutely. I'll take that. Absolutely. Give me that. Fantastic. I'll take it. Pig leather tabby boots. Ew. Am I fucking... Am I wearing like these... Those cringe-ass weeb boots? That's whatever. I'm, I'm fucking... I'll get over it real quick. I'll get over it. 
I'll get over it when I'm suddenly able to start dodging shit. Yes. <laughs> Alright, let's go. Let's get the fuck out of here. Okay, so you said it was north? Or, no, sorry. I meant, uh, yeah. For you guys, it'd be that way. For me, for me it'd be that way. Stage right. Uh, uh. <sighs> Alright. Doctor! Please help me. I'm on death's door right now. Please. Please, sir. Can you eat more than one food stuff at a time? Just want to be sure of that. I don't want to, you know, step on any toesies. What's the doctor here? Hello? Doctor? Docky? Vince? Hey, what's... Oh. A well-knit man steps in front of you, crossing his arms and spreading his legs. Slightly apart. Just a little bit. He's like... He's like... It's like when, uh... It's like when in prison, when they just, like, ever so slightly lower their pants to show their underwear, just to mark the, like... If you wanna. But, you know, you don't have to. Simultaneously. He addresses you with a light, raspy voice. Hold it right there, sister. This alley here has been locked... This alley here has been locked to us. You wanna pass through, you gotta pay a one-time fee. Hmm? I'm not paying you anything, you mangy street rat. Now step aside before I turn your brain into graffiti. You're either very brave or very stupid, sister. Threatening me on my own turf. And then I just have Intimidate where it's like, Yes. Is, can both be an answer? I don't need to be brave. I got enough firepower to blow you and your little cardboard city to upper under rail. I'll be passing through her now. Unless you want a demonstration. His stare is nothing but anger. But after exchanging it with comrades, he motions you to pass. You get to pass. Bellas. Finally got a little something out of that. Charisma build! Barrel? Whoa, hey, you guys got some stuff over here. Nice. Did I never check that locker? What the fuck? Hold on a minute, let me check that locker real quick. Oh, that's right. Okay, well, I normally just kill them. Well, my 40 health says otherwise. Please, sir. Please, sir. Oh, oh, what is this? Like, Black Eel territory? Fishing rod? Oh, they just have it like... Eel tastes so much better than Rat Hound. Hell, everything tastes better than the bloody Rat Hound. Hell, everything tastes better than the fucking Rat Hound. I bet I could eat your ass if it tastes better than that. You can still kill them if you want. Nobody will stop you. Really? How many are there? Two, three, four? I do have an energy shield emitter. How much do I have on that? What's the energy on that? 30? Okay, pretty good. Four? Tell you what. I'll think about it. Second Lieutenant Garen? Sir? Is this where the embassy is or something? Old citizen, this is a restricted area. What is this place? This is an under-rail protectorate outpost. It also houses the United Nations Embassy. There we go. Can I see the ambassador? Do you have business with the ambassador? Is he expecting you? Yes, he's expecting me. And you are? Bertha Trudor Southgate Station! Oh, yes, well... Uh... Got Trude of Southgate Station? We were expecting you. You may enter the embassy. This game does factions really good. Dude, I'm about to be a faction, okay? This is about to be the this is about to be the uh, West Side Story. Oh, fixer! I'm assuming that's the doctor. <coughs> Pretty bad one by the by the taste of it, sir. <coughs> <coughs> sir, my uh, sir, please. I'm I'm broken. I'm a broken and beaten man. You got ghosts in your blood. Fucking uh, drink some whiskey. Take some cocaine. You'll be fine. Security camera? Oh! Halt! Before you can meet the ambassador. Why do I always do that? Halt! Before you can meet the ambassador, you must unready your weapon, grenades, and other dangerous devices and put them in your backpack. If you reach for any of these during your stay on the embassy grounds, you will be neutralized. 
When you enter the courtyard behind me, take the first double door to the right. The ambassador is expecting you. Do not interfere with any operations inside the base. You know, I gotta say, for an embassy in Junktown, this place is as big as Junktown by the looks of it. What? Oh. Just kill me. Kill me. I have to do it by self? Oh, they'd be like, they come in just like, oh, you got to shoot your weapon. I thought you'd think they'd fucking, you'd think they'd fucking do it for me. A very, very large, very large penis energy on this game, all right? Not, uh, this is, this is, um, mm, mm. All right, she this. All right, we good now? Are we good now? Do I have to, like, put my grenades out of my utility belt? Immersion. <laughs> my fucking immersion. Throw my weapons, too. I have to fucking detach them from my utility belt. All right, all right. There. Are we ready now? I'm go I'm walking through the fucking... The, the fucking metal detector. Are we good now? Okay, beautiful. First double door on my right. Sir, 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 sir. Excuse me. Excuse me, sir. Ma'am, deputy. Yeah, <laughs> deputy, what's going on? The young deputy politely addresses you. Uh, go right in, the ambassador's ready to meet you. Even non-lethal stuff like flashbangs? Dude, hey man, if I were sitting here trying to protect a fucking Southgate Station ambassador, the last thing I want is a migraine, okay? And tinnitus. So, uh, what can you tell me about him? Only the very best. Ambassador Ath Athanus is one hard-working, intelligent man who is sincerely devoted to promoting and realizing the idea of unification here in South Underrail. It is a slow and time-consuming process, but the United Stations are gaining more and more support, thankfully. Now, the door to the ambassador's office may be always open, but that doesn't mean he's not a busy man, especially now. Please keep that in mind when going to his office. Thank you. Thank you, I will. Sir! Ma'am. Ambassador Athanus. Why are you named Anus? Sir? You enter the office to see a short, thin man already standing behind his desk to greet you. Neatly dressed, neatly shaved, smooth-faced, and scar-free. And in possession of straight white teeth. The man is a northerner. He greets you with a polite voice. Welcome to the United Stations Embassy, Miss Gertha True. We've been expecting you. Uh, Vera sent you these trading documents. Very good, very good. I feel like rolling R's in that one. Very good, very good. Usually I'd allow this sort of information to be wired, but we have reason to believe that the network going through Junkyard might have been compromised. You never know who might be listening and what they can do, even with harmless trading agreement info. Just so you know, as a representative of Southgate Station, he's, just, he's a northerner, we like him. Careful, he's a northerner. <laughs> right, he's up from uh, Northumberland. You're free to move around most of the embassy premises, and can also use our elevator to South Railroad Outpost. Really? It's out of order at the moment because of the earthquake, but we're working on fixing it. Well, well, we're endearing to fix it at the fastest speed that we possibly can, and... Uh, who do you suspect has hacked the junkyard network? Not quite sure yet, but there is an ongoing investigation. That's what they say when they don't have an ongoing investigation. Until further notice, I ask that any sensitive information coming from SGS and our other trading partners in the South be delivered physically. Understandable. I'm sure we'll get to the bottom of this soon, so that the communication can continue as before. I had other questions for you. Yes? I have to go now. Take care, Miss Gertha Trude. Feel free to come back anytime if there's something you wish to discuss. Yes, I have a question for you. Oh, yeah, what is that? What is that, Miss Gertha Trude? I have to go now. Uh, I am bleeding out of my asshole, and, uh, I saw, and I saw a man that looked like he didn't own a medical license for the entirety of his medical training. And so I'm gonna go and, uh, ask him for some stimmies.
Ta-ta. Is there any medical treatment here in this place? This place seems cleaner. Please. Please, I can't kill anyone. Can I can't kill anyone until I get medical treatment. Is there anybody in the embassy that, that has any medical treatment expertise? Please. 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 Well, no. My god, you think... So what? Like, if anybody in there gets hurt, they have to come out here and walk 200 feet to fucking meet this guy who's sitting in front of a bunch of bloody rags for medical gurneys? I get that, like, to establish trust, you have to give trust. But what in any of this situation is trustworthy? In any of this. In any of this. Don't worry. Fixer has a lot of experience. I'm not... I'm, I'm, I'm not... I'm not... I'm not... I'm not questioning his experience. I'm questioning his... Hygiene. Blood but no bodies means he's good at his job. Either that, or he's bad. It could mean that he's really good at it, or it could mean that he's really bad at it. Think about it. Fixer. The doctor's suit is covered with dried blood and other foul stains, its smell matching its appearance. As you come near, he slowly turns to you, inspecting your body for wounds with wild eyes. Seem as if they're about to pop out of their sockets. Contrary to his stare, his voice is slow and steady. Which means it wins the race. Feeling pain? I can fix you. I'm hurt. Can you stitch me back up, Doc? Three Sharons. Or five if you want the anesthetic. My God.